this is Stacey Johnson and you're watching UK Rewind's Weekend Recap. Firstly, a big congratulations to Kelly Hubley, whose golden goal in overtime against UT Martin made history. The six, a chance, a shot, and a score! The Wildcats come through with a goal here in the first overtime period. It gave UK their first NCAA tournament win in program history and the first postseason win under Coach Lipsitz. Also, in more NCAA news, Kelly McCumber placed first in the NCAA Southeast Regionals and Chelsea Oswald placed third and will be going on to race in the NCAA Cross Country Championships. They will be joined by Luis Orta, who placed 12th and qualified to race as an individual qualifier. The history continues with the women's basketball team winning its 21st consecutive home game, which is the third largest streak in school history. A lot of that had to do with Adia Mathis, who moved up to number 11 in the all-time scoring charts at UK with 1,451 career points and was also named to the John R. Wooden Award Women's Preseason Top 30 list. The men's basketball team was on the road up in Brooklyn at the new Barclays Center where they took on Maryland. The Cats dominated the first half, but things got sloppy and Maryland tied it up 53 to 53. But it was Lexington's native, Jared Polson, who came in to calm down the Cats and earned 10 points, two of which were free throws and less than eight seconds left to give the Cats a three point cushion to win the game 72 to 69. Also, Kyle Wiltshire was named SEC Player of the Week. The men's soccer team played number 19 SMU for the Central USA semifinals and tied it up 2-2 with goals from Wilder and Cornelian. The game came down to a PK shootout where the Cats fell to SMU. The number two ranked UK rifle team took down the Navy this weekend, making their record 6-0 on the year, with the help of Henry Young Hanel, who tied the air rifle program best of 597. This is Stacey Johnson reminding you to take a pause and check out the latest plays on UK Rewind. Also, follow us on Twitter at UK Rewind and at Kentucky Wildcats TV.